If you guys want to be ahead of the competition when New World Eternum drops on October 15th, you guys are going to want to be doing this to get the best start possible. First things first, when you first start out the game, you're going to want to pick the Bow Spear Archetype. In my opinion, this is the best archetype to play through the story with. A lot of people will ask me why the bow spear. I would pick the bow and the spear over the musket rapier, for example, because the bow spear have better AoE abilities. This means that they are more capable of cleaning up a pack of mobs than, say for example, the rapier or the musket that are more single target focused. The next thing you're going to want to do when you start your adventure in New World Eternum is you're going to want to hit start or escape and you're going to want to go to the store pretty much right away. You want to scroll down until you find consumables and you want to scroll down again until you get to the XP boosters. Pretty much all of these XP boosters are going to help out a new player. A new player might not need the season XP booster. That's just because this gives you double XP bonus bonus to the season pass and you can't start doing the season pass until you're max level but a new player can definitely benefit from a gathering xp booster day one a weapon xp booster day one and a proficiency booster day one the proficiency booster just gives you 10 percent more yield when you're gathering things this one's not huge the main two is the gathering xp booster and the weapon xp booster getting double xp when you're gathering items will just mean that you can gather the next item twice as quick as the guy who didn't get these boosters you can capitalize on this and get the materials that no one else can get but will need and you can sell it to them as soon as you can get it you'll make a ton of money in the first couple days doing this the Weapon XP booster is pretty much the same thing. Being able to level up your weapons twice as fast as the guy who didn't get the XP boosters is huge for the first couple days. Having access to every skill in the weapon skill tree will help you out so much instead of struggling through a fight, having the extra skills will actually help you out. You can use your XP boosters by opening up your inventory and down at the bottom here you'll see a tab called augments. Go ahead and open that up and in here is where you will find all your XP boosters. The next thing you're going to want to do pretty much right away when you start your new world Eternum adventure. When the game finally plops you on the beach here, it's going to ask you to make a tool. It's going to be like a skinning knife or an axe or something. It's going to ask you to do it at this campfire. I would recommend making all of the tools that you can right away, right off the bat. You can find all the materials needed for the tools literally around this area. If you do this, you can start gathering any of the materials that you end up coming across, which again will make you a lot of money in the first couple days. The next thing you're going to want to do to get the best possible start in New World Eternum is to make sure you head over to this location in Everfall as soon as it pops up for you and grab your mount. This will save you so much time when leveling up through New World Eternum or even gathering resources going node to node. And the last thing you're going to want to do to get an advantage in New World Eternum on launch day is use the New World map. I'll leave a link to this website down below in the description. But basically, if you're looking for any type of resources, you can go on this map and it'll show you exactly where you can find the most of them or the best spot to farm. Whether it's wood or ores, you can find anything you need on this map and where to farm it. Definitely use this on day one and through your journey. All right, guys, that's all the information I have to get the best start possible in New World Eternum. Good luck out there. If this video helped you, make sure to give it a like, subscribe, the channel if it did and i'll see you guys in the future P -p 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 pace